Torin gingerbread Polish, Pierniki Torunski, German, Thorner Leb Kuchen, is a traditional Polish gingerbread that has been produced since the Middle Ages in the city of Torin. History Old Polish sayings connect Torin with making of some form of gingerbread, and the expansion of the craft, which started in the 13th century. A considerable factor behind the development of gingerbread making in Torin was its excellent location. Situated on high quality soil, the area provided fine wheat for flour, while nearby villages provided honey. The necessary spices were brought from remote countries, mainly India, via a route through the Black Sea and Lwów to the Holy Roman Empire, where the spices were transported by North German trade companies. Some also came by sea to the port of Danzig. The very first mention of Torin gingerbread comes from 1380 and speaks of a local baker called Nyklos C. Zana. The product quickly gained fame across Poland and abroad. Torin and the city of Nuremberg, itself famous for special pancakes, were eager to protect the secrets of their recipes from each other. Finally in 1556, they formed an agreement by which each city could bake the specialties of the other, the artisans weren't the only ones engaged in the production of the delicacy. In the 16th century, the Cistercian order on the outskirts of Torin prospered mainly due to this activity and even sold their product to other countries. During the 17th century, the well-known workshop of the Grauer family appeared. The city authorities were supportive of the lucrative trade and issued several tax breaks on spice imports and export by bakers' guilds so that the trade could be increased. In the 18th and 19th century, the city saw a fall in baking and other craftsmanship. In 1825, only three bakers were left. With the advent of capitalism, large companies took over from the local craftsmen and mass production of the gingerbread ensued. The largest factory was owned by Gustav Wies, based on tradition dating from 1763, when Johann Wies started to bake gingerbread. Gustav Traugott Wies inherited a small workshop after his father Andreas in 1824 and changed it into a large company. In 1875 the Torin Gazette wrote on New Year's Eve that due to the demand it was even sold in Africa. Other exotic places of export included Turkey, Japan, China and Honolulu. In 1913, Gustav Wies, a descendant of Gustav Traugott Wies, constructed a factory which, after World War I ended, was employing over 500 workers. Gustav Wies sold it in January 1939 to the Polish company, Spolum, and left for his other gingerbread factory in Germany. The company in Torin still exists and is the oldest confectionery company in Poland today and one of the oldest in the world. Besides Gustav's factory, there was also the Hermann Thomas Company founded in 1857, which in 1907 employed 200 workers. Another important company engaged in the production of gingerbread was founded by Jan Ruchniewicz in 1907. The enterprise prospered quite successfully and had 50 workers. It was especially known for the ornamental gingerbread topped with Torin's crest. Torin gingerbread in Polish culture Pierniki Torunski, as they are known in Polish, are an icon of Poland's national cuisine. They have traditionally been presented as a gift by the city of Torin to Polish leaders, artists and others who have distinguished themselves in Polish society, and to Polish kings. Baking molds survive with likenesses of King Sigismund III of Poland, King Władysław IV Vasa and Queen Cecilia Renata as well as the royal seal with the Polish eagle and crests of several provinces. Other notables who have received gift gingerbread from the city include Marie Casimir Louise, French princess and widow of King John III Sobieski, Napoleon Bonaparte, during whose visit the whole city was illuminated and bells were rung all over the city, Zygmunt Krasinski, one of Poland's three bards, painter Jan Matyko, actress Helena Modjeska, Marshal Józef Pilsudski, pianist Artur Rubinstein, poet Czesław Miłosz, Lech Walesa, and Pope John Paul II. Since at least the Middle Ages, Pierniki have been connected with Torin in Polish proverbs and legends. One legend claims that gingerbread was a gift from the Queen of the Bees to the apprentice Bogomil. A 17th-century epigram by poet Friedrich Hoffmann speaks of the four best things in Poland. The vodka of Gdansk, Torin gingerbread, the ladies of Krakow, and the Warsaw shoes.
The 18th century poet and fabulist Ignacy Krasitsky, who greatly favored the gingerbread, wrote of them in his celebrated poems. When the precocious 15-year-old composer Frédéric Chopin visited Shafarnia, a small village near the river Drevetsa, he stopped over in Torin, where he was a guest of his godfather, the penologist Friedrich Florian Skarbek. Chopin sampled the city's famous confection and grew so fond of it that he wrote a letter about it to his friends and colleagues. He even sent some to Warsaw. In honor of this, Poland's largest producer of Torin gingerbread, the Copernic Confectionery Company, has created a special heart-shaped gingerbread called Scherzo, bearing Chopin's likeness on the wrapper. Torin holds an annual celebration of gingerbread called Suito Pirnica, the gingerbread festival. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Current producers. There are two main producers of Torin gingerbread, the confectionery factory, Copernic, S.A., and the Torin Bakery. The first upholds its legal rights to the brand name and is the successor to a company that was founded in 1763 by Johann Wies. The second company was formed by Torin bakers who specialized in producing gingerbread. Its aim is to spread knowledge of the craft and to produce fine gingerbread for restaurants, parties and elite meetings. See also List of desserts List of Polish desserts Krakow gingerbread